Hey guys, for the past few years I actually had not been using a couple of good speakers with myself when it comes to editing videos and also when it comes to making my covers. Therefore I actually got the need of buying two good new speakers. Therefore I actually researched through YouTube for a long period of time and then I thought these two speakers would do good. These two speakers are studio monitors and also they got Bluetooth which means I can connect my mobile phone even with these two speakers which sounded interesting for me. In today's video, it got 5 sections and they are going to be these. First, I'm going to do an unboxing video for you. As the second part of the video, I'm going to show you how to connect the RCA cable from your speakers to your PC. As the third part of the video, I'm going to show you how to connect your mobile phone to your speakers through Bluetooth. As the fourth part of the video, I'm going to show you how these two speakers look on my living room studio. You can let me know whether they look good or not. As the fifth part of the video, I'm gonna compare the original sounds of a music track with the JBL speakers and also through my laptop speakers. Important safety instructions. Output extension cables. RCA cable along with the 3.5 mm auxiliary jack that can be used to connect to the computer. AC input plug. These are the monitors. Let me check what's in here. Ooh, actually it's another 3 pin AC in cable. Let's have an idea what are the available things on this speaker. The left hand knob is for the volume control and the second button is to select the input mode. In front we have auxiliary input and also a headphone output. Behind we have a few other inputs. These are RCA inputs and then you have TRS inputs and also extension outputs for the second speaker. And also we could see the power button and also the power input. This is the second speaker where you connect the extension outputs to this. The bottom part is made out of rubber so it can bear many shocks. Along with this you get two different types of plugs. One is a 2 pin round one, the other one is a 3 pin squared one. Right, let's try connecting it to the speaker. Here I got the extension cables. contains two colors, one is a red wire and the other one is a black wire.
just connect the two wires according to the colors. Then you can connect the other ends to the other speaker. Here I got the RC cable. Now I'm gonna connect this to the speakers. Now I'm going to connect this auxiliary jack to my computer. Right, let's play with the input select button. Once you press it, you can move to different input methods. I moved to Bluetooth mode and then I kept pressing the button so I could get the pairing mode on. Now I can actually connect it to my mobile phone just like another Bluetooth speaker. So you can see I could connect to Bluetooth speaker without any issue. Now I'm gonna play some music through my phone to see how they sound. What do you think about it? Well, as I have already shown you what are the functions available on the speakers, let me show you how the two speakers look pretty nice on my living room studio. If you think I could provide you some value with this video, please make sure to like and subscribe my channel 
and also if you think this video is gonna be helpful for your friends please make sure to share with them and I'm gonna see you on another video have a nice week